everybody. Thanks for stopping by Mac Customs. Um, so we've been on a little break there. We took about a month off posting videos. Um, it's been busy though. We've we've been doing quite a bit around here. Um, what have we been doing? Uh, we've been moving the pigs around and uh, working in the gardens and uh, doing some landscaping and such. Yeah, this time of year, the end of the summer there, um, our biggest thing, we have all our potatoes harvested. Uh, they're cured, they're dried and weighed. And I think we end up with 50 pounds of potatoes, which we're pretty happy with, um, being that it's the first time that potatoes actually grew for us. Yep. Um, we have our garlic and our onions all um, dried out. They're ready to go. Um, the big thing, what I'm most happy about is uh, where the pigs were we kept moving their pen every probably week or so yeah every week or two depending on the rain and so. yeah yeah the days when there was heavy rain we had to move them quite a bit faster they dig up a lot um, the days when it was hot i added buckets of water in there to uh, give them some mud and that so they could chew it up Yep, they did a great job uh, landscaping. Um, so that ended up creating, as we were moving the pen, it's uh, 20 feet by about 50 feet, I yeah. think, um, where they kind of dug it all up. Um, come the spring there, we're going to get it all tilled, and that's going to be either a new garden or a fourth added garden. I'm not really sure. This year we just kind of kept adding gardens everywhere we could make them. Um, our pumpkins and our cucumbers are doing really good, too. Yep. Um, we planted those, it was pretty late, it was like July, I think early yeah, July. We'll definitely do them earlier next year. Yeah, um, I'm super, super happy with the pumpkins and the cucumbers. Um, so we've been making a lot of homemade pickles, um, cucumbers for, well, us and the chickens and the pigs, so good, good free food for the animals. Um, the pigs love the pumpkins. I will definitely be doing a really early large pumpkin patch next year for them. And also the chickens love them too, and it's good to have them this time of year even for decorations. Um, so yeah, that worked out really good. Um, we've been doing a lot of uh, apple picking as well. We have a lot of apple trees on the property. So we've been making cider, um, which our first time, it turned out so good. We've been drinking so yeah, much cider. <laughs> um, apple jelly. For, yep. He actually makes better apple jelly than I do. Mine never turns out. Mine ends up turning into cider because I don't know why, but we'll leave him make the jelly. <laughs> um, but yeah, um, other than that, we just kind of wanted to make a quick video, just kind of let you know where we've been, what we've been doing. And the big part of this video is we want to say thank you to so many people who have sent us stuff from our Amazon wish list. Um, didn't expect, didn't expect that. Um, so yeah, that's amazing. We thank you everyone that thinks about us. Um, anyone that watches our videos, leaves comments, um, and especially those who have been sending us little gifts. So something here first thing there is from roger anderson let me show that these are uh, like a heat shrink yeah, nice heat shrink set big one yeah there's so many uh so many different sizes there and we use that a lot when we're doing installs of like light bars and winches um it definitely comes in handy um so roger said uh great video thanks only hitches the sound is a little low cheer from roger anderson <laughs> yeah and now this was sent to us a, a little a long time ago. A long time ago. Um, we have since been given some mics. So we're hoping that since then that the videos have improved. Um, I think they have. We have a few comments of people saying that the sound is getting a little bit better. So that's awesome. And then we have these came from Terry. Um, so these are some magnets. <laughs> Terry seen me scrambling for a magnet one day. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> yeah, so they arrived. That was awesome. And uh, Terry left a little note. It says, love your channel and all the projects and cool, cool stuff you do. Hope these are something you can use in the shop. And they definitely are. So thank you so much, Terry. And these here, what are those? Those came Cotter in. Pins. Cotter pins? Oh, yeah. So those are a nice set. There's, again, tons of different sizes of cotter pins. Um, I learned from experience, if you don't put a cotter pin in, your tire will fall off. Because that happened to me. Um <laughs> It is what it is. Um, but that it just says uh, from a YouTube subscriber, hope this is something you can use around the shop. Um, so thank you so much to whoever sent those. And now these. Um, grinding disc? Yep. 
so yeah, we had a couple different uh, grinding discs on our wish list there. These were sent to us again. It just says from a YouTube subscriber. It says, I love your videos. I like seeing what you guys create. And I hope these get put to use on a really cool project. I think these were indeed used on building the dump trailer. Yep. Or the dump trailer slash water tote trailer, which that water tote saved us so much hassle. Oh my God. All summer. We just filled the big toad up, took it, uh, filled the pig's water, the chickens, watered the gardens, because our gardens are kind of spread out all over the yard. So yeah, those did get put to good use. They did build the trailer, and I'm sure they will be put to a lot more oh. use. We have a lot of projects that we're thinking of. Um, one of the big things that we're going to be doing next is doing a winter enclosure for the chickens. Um, so right now they're in kind of their summer, they're fenced off with just a little, little chicken coop. We're hoping to move them into kind of the, I call it the brooder barn where all the little chicks start off. Um, but we'd like to put them in there for the winter just to make it easier on us. And it keeps them warm and happy in that. So that's one of the projects we'll be doing. Um, I'm sure there's a hundred other things we have planned. Yeah. Um, and of course we'll take you guys along as we're doing that. Uh, what we're going to do now, um, so these were all the gifts for the shop, I'm going to take you guys into the house and I'm going to show you some of the amazing gifts that people have sent us uh, that we've been using around the house. So we'll, uh, we'll head in there. We just want to say thank you to our subscriber who sent these couple items to us. Uh, right here we have some feeders for the chicks, which are perfect because we have the new layers right now and we also have more meat birds coming in the next few weeks. And also included in that package, there was some stuff from our homesteading list, uh, some measuring cups that I had. So thank you so much for sending those to us. I apologize, there was no name on the bag, but regardless, thank you so much for thinking about us. We just received this from an Amazon delivery. I have a, a note here from D. It says, I seen this on your homestead wish list, and I wanted to send you both a little something. I really enjoy watching you two develop your homestead and hope to see some baking videos in the future from Dee. So thank you so much Dee. Um, I will do my best at doing some baking videos and uh, thanks for supporting our channel and thanks for thinking about us. This morning, So we want to thank uh, JR. Got a little message here. Keep up the awesome videos. Hope these are something you can use around your homestead in the near future from JR. So thank you so much and these are pig nipples which we will absolutely be using in the very near future. So thanks so much. Thank you to our YouTube subscriber who sent this to us. Bugsy's really protecting everything. So I had a couple of items on our Amazon cart or our wish list there for the house. I had a adjustable shower curtain, these little hanging clips, and those are just some screws for the electrical outlets. Yeah, freshen them up a little. Uggs really seems to like the shower curtain. But yeah, I had these two items on the on my list with a little memo saying I was going to use them to freshen up my shoe closet. So the little note that came with the gift said, I'm sending you these because I'm intrigued to see this shoe closet. So when it's finished and I put these to use, I will definitely show you. So again, thank you to our YouTube subscriber. There was no name, um, just a little note, just said from a YouTube subscriber. Um, so yeah, thank you so much to whoever sent those. Hey everybody, so here is that extendable shower curtain that was sent to us and the clips. So like I said, uh, my plan was to have all my boots hanging. This made it so easy. These just clip onto each pair of boots. Hang right on the extendable shower curtain here. Um, <laughs> there's quite a bit of weight on this rod. So what I did to keep it from creeping down the wall is it was kind of sliding down as it went. I just put some of these shelf brackets to hold it. So it just keeps it at the level that I want. Um, because right now I think there's in excess of 15 pairs of boots hanging here. So there's quite a bit of weight, but it's doing exactly what I wanted. I love the look of it. 
And uh, again, I just want to say thank you so much for sending uh, the clips and uh, the curtain rod for us. Um, it was it was awesome to think of us, and I love how it turned out. We just want to say thank you so much to Fred and Margie for sending us this. Uh, it's a kitchen scale that we had on our homesteading wish list. The plan for that is to measure, or sorry, to weigh the chickens once we process them, so we'll know exactly how much we have. And they left us a really nice little note here. We enjoy your YouTube channel and always love seeing what you're building, designing, or fixing from Freddie and Marg. So thank you guys so much for that. We just received another awesome gift from a YouTube subscriber. Um, this came at the absolute perfect time. Um, as you can see, it is a food sealer and the bags as well. Um, basically like a whole little kit here. Um, so this was super exciting to open up as a nice surprise uh, just two days before we were ready to process the chickens. Um, so again, super good timing. There was a little note included. It said I wanted to send something that would be useful around the homestead um, from JE. So thank you so much there and this will definitely be used around the homestead here. So thank you very much for that. Okay guys, so those were all the awesome gifts that um, our subscribers had sent to us. Um, we really, really appreciate that. Um, yeah, it all helps out. Yeah, yeah, definitely put it all to use. Thank you. Yeah, so uh, we just want to thank everybody. Um, again, like we don't expect gifts from our subscribers. That's just a super nice bonus. Um, you can help our channel out by hitting subscribe, leaving a comment, liking the videos, um, sharing videos with people who may enjoy them as well. Um, so every little bit helps us grow and uh, we appreciate that. So uh, now we're back. Um, we should be posting videos every couple of days now, um, same as we were before. So yeah, we'll, uh, we're going to end the video for now and uh, we'll just see you in the next video.